So here's another example of um, texturing issues in SketchUp. This is one of those uh, handrail stanchions. And now that I've gotten rid of some of the extraneous um, textures, I'm looking at this and thinking, why is uh, the inside of this texture, the outside is is marked uh, is covered with texture, but the inside seems to be textured also. And then when I edit it, and I select one of these faces and come down here and it says, yeah, over here it says, yeah, the outside has been textured and the inside hasn't. And I look at that and that's the same. They're all the same, but yet obviously, uh, you know, who are you going to believe? Uh, this panel here or your lion eyes? And so something obviously is going on. And from experience, I, I do know what this is. And that is that a texture has been applied at the component level. This is the catwalk stanchion. And just in selecting the component, as I do here, now I come down and say, yep, look at this. The component itself has uh, got the texture on it. And what this does, when you, when you add a texture onto a component like this, it automatically applies the texture to all faces in the component, including the back faces. And those back faces get exported to MSTS, and effectively it doubles the polys. And so you don't want to do that. And the way you solve that is you go back and you find your default texture thing, and you apply that to the component level, It'll take this away, bing, the component now no longer has a texture, and now that we can see on the inside, the inside faces don't have a texture, and um, the poly count now is only going to be for the outside faces, and that is good because this particular component, we have, um, how many of them? We have presently 46 of these stanchions in the model. So 46 times uh, 8 is another, um, say, 400 polys. And we're going to be adding a lot more of components, uh, instances of this component as we, uh, in the next video, as we uh, fix up one of the hand railings. And uh, the bottom line is, is it adds up. It can add up a lot with with a simple thing like this that where it really is only a handful of polys, but when you copy and paste them all over the place, um, you can wind up with a humongous uh, number of uh, polys being exported to the game.